Now it's your turn. Did some of the situations highlighted in the previous videos seem familiar to you? Are you interested and want to get started with O365? Would you like to know which apps you can use and how they can best be integrated into your daily work? Are you perhaps unsure about how to begin? If you answer yes to some of the questions above, here are your next steps. Corporate learning company TTS to create a scoping workshop to support you in defining objectives and mapping out future working processes within O365. First, at the onset of the workshop, we help you identify which departments and colleagues are involved in your daily work processes. Focusing on typical office scenarios, we then help you pinpoint the current challenges, needs, and opportunities relevant to you. From there, we support you in defining your goals for making team collaboration more efficient and in selecting the appropriate O365 tools for this purpose. Next, we will answer all your questions about working with O365, such as, how can I best structure my work with O365? How can our team best coordinate our tasks in the Teams app? How do I keep communication in my team or department well organized? Should I stop sending emails and use the Teams chat or Yammer instead? When do I use which kind of communication? As a third step, we help you define a common set of guidelines for using O365 that best fits your team processes and procedures. In this phase of the workshop, you will find answers to the following types of questions. Which data should be stored on SharePoint, OneDrive, Teams, or locally on my PC? Which application should I use for which activity? How do I keep track of the colleagues with whom I share my data? Another example involves working with the Teams tool. What tasks do team owners have? How should I name the different teams? How do I structure my teams? What is the difference between a team and a channel? Fourth, we will look together at how the agreed-upon guidelines should be communicated to others, which is crucial for smooth collaboration in O365. If you are wondering how to document the guidelines and make them accessible to others, we can help you. So you can consistently monitor the effectiveness of the defined guidelines and continually improve them. We also address the following questions in this workshop phase. How do I track the progress of O365 implementation? Does the current use of the O365 tools make sense for our daily working procedures? Finally, we will discuss all your open technical questions, like for example, how can a team member find a file in Teams quickly? Or is it possible to retrieve the older file that was deleted by mistake? All those are topics that TTS will support you in finding the best solutions for your team.